an online rumor claimed the Queen was going to die yesterday, sparking a shocked reaction from royal fans and a brusque response from Buckingham Palace. The shock claim was made on online message board Reddit, with the original message and the user's personal account now mysteriously deleted. The original post was first uploaded by a Reddit user called Beefy underscore Cabbage on 27 of December, gaining over 50,000 upvotes, indicating approval, and 7,000 comments. The rumor has since spread like wildfire, with Buckingham Palace responding by refusing to comment on the Shah claims. Other Reddit users said the post was either a creepy prediction for the Queen's death, or a mistake which has sparked a M15 response. One user said, this is one of those posts that's going to be a part of a YouTube video called Creepy Unexplainable Reddit Posts. Another wrote, imagine if the Queen gets on Reddit and sees this. A third said said, plot twist, this is the Queen's alt account and she is orchestrating all of this to fake her death and pass on the throne. One user even broke down the mathematical likelihood of the Queen dying yesterday, as predicted in the original post. They said. Elizabeth II is currently 92 years old. Via this website, the odds for a 92-year-old woman to die within the next year of her life is 16.06%, which will be rounded up to 16.1% for simplification. Dividing this probability evenly among all 365 days of the year, which is not how it works, but it's all that we have to go off of, each day of her 92nd year. The Queen has about a 0.04411% chance of dying on any given day. Now, in order to fulfill Beefy underscore Cabbage's legendary prediction, the Queen would need to not die before January 5th, and then die on that day. There are 9 days before the 5th, 27th 4th, so the probability ends up being 100% to 0.04411% 0.04411% the first term representing the 9 days she would survive and the second term representing the day she would die. By this expression, the Queen has 0.04393% chance of dying on January 5, 2019. This is about a 1 in 2276 chance. So it's pretty unlikely, but definitely still within the realm of possibility, that she'll die then. God save the Queen. The Queen has taken an active role in the royal family, and is officially the longest reigning monarch in British history. There have been no official reports on the Queen's ill health and the energetic monarch continues to pack on her agenda with numerous royal events. Her Majesty has taken on more engagements in 2018 than in 2017, increasing her workload up to 25%. However, the Queen underwent eye surgery in May to remove a cataract, before attending Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's wedding. In addition, a Kensington Palace source previously told The Sun how the Queen's knees were hurting her while she attended the Chelsea Flower Show in May this year. They said, she was talking to friends at the Chelsea Flower Show and said her knees were playing up. But she is reluctant to have an operation due to the time it would take to recover. She is incredibly brave. People from her and Philip's generation battle through problems and carry on. And Her Majesty doesn't like to cause any fuss. There have been no official palace reports on the Queen's long-term health, 